Can ice on the ocean floor provide a new energy source? Will kitchen countertops someday clean themselves? Could a tiny golden cage carry medicine through the human bloodstream? This is the world where Zhao Zheng conducts research and imagines the future. These are the big problems and um, facing to the humanity. So I certainly, as a scientist, would want to contribute. Zheng's journey into a world that can't be seen with a microscope requires sophisticated calculations and powerful computerized research. His discoveries attract attention from both the scientific and popular press. Yeah, this is someone who, who literally is known around the world for what he does. Zheng's most recent discovery involves two-dimensional ice that, under pressure, forms cages that can hold molecules from another substance. The research could be used to help scientists tap into vast reserves of methane on the ocean floor or trap carbon dioxide. Can we use ice as a media to, um, in, to, in, to incorporate CO2 to, uh, to reduce the CO2 amount in the air to, to element greenhouse gas? Zheng's research also provides important clues in how to develop words, super hydrophobic materials yeah, that resist water, just like the petal on a flower. Material scientists and engineers have long wanted to create materials that could be used for self-cleaning surfaces or micro-robots that walk on water. So this is the kind of really solid fundamental research that absolutely um, often underpins those kinds of discoveries down the road. Singh says the Nebraska Research Initiative helps make the university a good place to do cutting-edge research. It's like a, a venture capital which allow us to do uh, very highly risk and uh, potentially transform transformative research. And uh, we really benefit from this funding source to, to break new ground.